That was no every time. Guys, it's so, it's so great to be back. Touching butts. Having fun. We, just for the record, we have never touched butts on this show. Not on the show, but just in general, touching butts is fun. No way I can pick this. I can't kill anybody, and I can't pick anything. This is a fucking... Why did this happen? I don't know what the dog's mad about. I seem to recall that doing something. Oh, yeah, because the bug zapper. Who invented this machine? Whoever lived in this bombed out house. Who lived in this bonged out house? Oh, man, I'm living in this bonged out house. I bet you somebody would do that. Oh, man. Is this that comedy man Seth Rogen? Anyway. Sud, dude. He doesn't say sud, dude. I know. All he says is Seth Rogen. Did you see Infinity War yet? <coughs> I'm Seth Rogen. Why was Seth Rogen in it? Seth Rogen is he Thanos? He not Seth Rogen. He plays Star Lord. Oh, wow, what a what a departure. Although I can see it. <laughs> they like to switch it up every so often. They want to give everyone a chance. Yeah. <laughs> That'd be funny. Everybody was just like, "All right, everybody, now just take your number, and when we call you, you will be in a Marvel movie." Just take a number. There's I'm, seven billion of you. You'll all get in. Just please wait in an orderly line. No, it's actually how it is. Everyone's gonna get a role one day. Yeah, I can't wait till I'm um. I get to play. Smash, play in. I'm gonna play Gamora next time. That's really good. You know what? I think it's really progressive to give uh to give a cool colored person, uh, female to a white man. I think that's very progressive. Well. With all due respect, she's been played by 13 million other people before she's going to get to me. So. Wow. Um, it's still very progressive in its own way. Yeah. Sometimes the opposite of progression is progression. That's Whoa! Oh! Man, this, I, if I can put my high-capacity mofo on this. But you're not allowed to do that. Okay, so let's put some money into um, getting stronger. Yeah, do you want rifles, semi-autos, or, or friends? So this is my shotguns and my hunting rifle. Yeah. An orange, yeah. So that, that'll help a little bit. So it won't yeah. do anything with this. If you were what would if you were going to be a superhero, what would you want to play? Like in a, in an acting role. Like what's a superhero that you'd be like stoked? I'd be stoked. Honestly, I don't think I want to be. I don't. I'll tell you, who I don't want to be. Okay. I'll I definitely that. don't think I would do a good Iron Man. Okay. I kind of like. I, you can do DC too. It doesn't just have to be Marvel. Okay. I, see, I think I would be like a. I would love a Loki-esque role. See, I could see you almost as Deadpool in a, in a way. I'm not like that. I'm not like that try-hard edgy though. That's true. But I, I feel like you'd be. I feel like you'd be very good at being very goofy on stage. See, I'm what you call a. What the hell's going on over here? Ferris well, performing surgery. May, perhaps a uh, benevolent. Bene, ben, what's the word? Benevolent. No. Benevolent. Benevolent. Benevolent trickster type. Mm -hmm. Who's overall good. Fuck you. Wow, really? Who's overall good, but needs to fuck around a little bit before he does the stuff he has to do. That's my thing. Okay. I thought those fusion cells were fusion could, Oh, you know what? Oh, you know what would also be good for that? If you were kind of going with a... You could, uh, like, Nightcrawler. I think that'd be kind of good for you. The Jake Gyllenhaal character? No. Yeah. <laughs> Um, no, the Banff guy from X Men, the guy who's like like the Panther looking guy who can teleport. I don't remember. Yeah, well, or like Quicksilver. Yeah, true, Quicksilver. I never saw the movie which featured Quicksilver, but I'm guessing. Yeah, I need to do more sneaking. That's my problem here. This dog's really helping out. Ooh, You're to, uh, guys, our arm exploded. Uh, Holy it, shit! It happens to everyone, right? Sometimes their arms. Whoa! When you reach a certain age, now we're doing a little more damage here. Yeah. It's weird that 20% makes my damage go up by five times. Dude, I love the fucking semi-autos, though, in this game. They're it's like cool. They're all fucking SVTs or something. Okay. I come in peace. I bring you love. I was thinking about that episode today. I don't know. Whoa! Why. That guy's too close for comfort. <laughs> This is not good. <laughs> See that fucking high level juke? Yeah, you, you juked him for you now, juked him for sure. Now to make the most of a terrible situation. Oh yeah. Oh girl. That won't be necessary. Did hurt him. Hammer don't hurt him. Hammer don't hurt him. 
All right, what else we got? I got the iron, the T iron. Just give it a couple shots right in the fucking ass. I mean, I'll a couple shots right in the ass. I mean, along that similar line, you could also do a flash. A flash is a very kind of goofy roll, but right. also he's like flash is cool. And also, he's secretly like one of the most powerful people in DC, even though nobody likes to talk about it. That's like one of those things where they like. First of all, I think they're all secretly super powerful if you take them to like their nth degree, right? Yeah. Some more than others. Like Wonder Woman probably can't destroy the universe. I think the like Flasher in, can. I think in some of the in some of her iterations where she like, uh, cause she's like Ares's daughter, so like I think there are some iterations of her where she like embraces kind of that side and she like becomes like awesome, kick-ass destroyer of worlds kind of thing. I'm into it. I did not know that. Actually, that's a really low amount of ri rats for as much as it heals. It's probably pretty good. It's probably pretty good. No, but like that, that I'm down with. Oh fuck, you're still alive, man, alive there, really. I think you did shoot off one of his He's hurt arms. pretty bad. Yeah. At this point, it's a mercy kill. I got lucky with that hit there. A two ball. They call me two ball. <laughs> this man had strange two balls on him. Uh, anyway, who do you think you would be? I don't know. Do you think if they came to you... I picture you as a wolverine. Exactly. That's, you say that's Bub me. a lot. I do. I, I wish I did, quite frankly. I know. It's a hard thing to incorporate into your daily yeah. word diet. If you, if someone came up to you and you're like, look, Tom C., we're making the Borderlands movie. Why don't you play Handsome Jack? Would you do it? Yeah, that's that's my role. Yeah. That's the one I was born to play. And not only because my first name is Handsome. Handsome Tom C. Y yeah. I always cut that out of my name just because I, I feel like it's braggadocious sometimes. Mm -hmm. This is a crate. Who's, was there a wrestler who was handsome? Ravishing Rick Rude. Um, handsome Harry Sanders. It was someone else. Handsome Harry Havoc. That's a great wrestler name. I like how you were like, yeah, even though you just made it up. <laughs> You're like, that one's great. Like you like you fit, remembered it. But it's a good one. It's a great name. Yeah. That would be a great wrestling name. There's Sexual Chocolate, Mark Henry. Um, I'm trying to think of anyone who's even... Ravishing recruits like your handsome guy, your classic handsome guy. Mm -hmm. Also, I just was thinking of it. I can't believe there was never a 70s basketball movie called Slam Funk. We can't confirm that there was not a basketball movie called that, because I think there probably is. Oh, shit. I forgot what kind of you. I do like the full, like, fucking pullback on the, uh... Boom, bitch! Yeah, that was great. Sorry. Ooh, my stomach. It, it hurt my stomach. Got a bad case of lead poisoning. My face got so much lead in it that my stomach hurt. It's like whenever like you like you like touch someplace and somewhere else itches. Sometimes mm. you get shot in the, in the face so hard, but then your stomach hurts. Oh hi, nice to meet you. <laughs> no, now we're doing the real damage. Just kidding. Yes. Okay. Oh, it kind of reminds. Uh, Maybe was, a little bit dramatic. It kind of reminds. Whoa. Me of the, um... <laughs> I, th I think I have more than zero chance to hit. Angry Bark! <laughs> what the fuck? I just need to lie down on that park bench. He's fine. Oh, he, he fell off. I like these. First of all, this is a private park bench. Yeah, what is the. I guess. Is this way, is like the sitting area thing? for like the maintenance of this subway. <laughs> like now, a break room for guys, the, let's for the take maintenance a break, worker. Yeah. yeah. You're. The wires will be completed in four to six hours, so sit, sit here. Dude, here's what always pisses me off, right? You get, like, a thing delivered or a service done, and, like, they give you a window of, like, the whole fucking day. Mm -hmm. Like, what is that shit? Like, what? Why can't At least you... uh, we've we've had to get a couple appointments for, for points during our day, and they're, they've been pretty good about calling us, like, w like a th uh, 30 minutes ahead of time or something like that. I didn't call, like, the day before and be like, okay, it's at one. Ooh! It's not that hard to give me a real time for shit. Well, the the we just got the our internet put in, and they gave us a two hour window, and then they called us half an hour before they were going to show. Yeah. And same with the fridge; they gave us like a four hour window, which was a little longer, obviously. I had to get you had to get a fridge. Yeah, that blows. We got a nice fridge. No, I'm sure it's a nice fridge, but it's fucking that's a, that's a that's a big cost. Yeah, but it'll, it's one of those things where it'll help, it'll help the resale value of the house when we do you go think? sell it again. Because you leave a fridge in it, you think so? Yeah. I would assume, I'm not trying to shit on your parade, classic phrase, that people would probably want to supply their own. 
Because like, you always hear like people be like, oh, I wouldn't want to get an in-ground pool because it ruins the value because people might choose something else, right? Well, it's true, but that's not the same thing. Like, if you don't... Uh, Why the pool, hell was I in the station? A pool is not as optional as a, is is more optional than a refrigerator. Is. Right, but in five years, your fridge might be outdated now that we have f- fusion powered fridges. True. You know what I mean? It's gonna be so fucking cold, you don't even understand it. <laughs> that's that's too cold for a fridge. Maybe for a freezer, but a fridge, I just need things. Like, no, somehow you know, it's so cold, but it's like exactly cold. It's like loops around. <laughs> it you u- that'd be cool if it uses the cold energy somehow to make the like to power it. Making all fridges stupid besides that fridge. Making them so dumb. No one would ever not buy that fridge because it would use no electric. That's the Play future. The it's weird that shit has to get hot to make things cold. And also, I'm going to say this even though it's not related. Oh, you're straight? So is spaghetti until it gets hot. <laughs> I just love saying that. Well, I think for the idea, it's the actual, for like fridges, it's actually, is that new cool quantum I saw? Hmm. To your left. Why, well, yes, it is. Is that two of these guys? doesn't matter in this game as much, but nice You can still plate. make quantum grenades. I don't remember how, but I know you can. I think you just need mad bomber or Maybe something. one can make it, but certainly not I. No, not at this point. <laughs> not at this stage of my life. I can never, never really justify going too deep into explosions in this game. Dude, I can. Dude, in New Vegas, it was fun as fuck. In New Vegas, it was really fun. In this game, like, no. Although the party maker or whatever... Party, party boy. It's fucking fun as hell. Tomsey party boy. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Anyway, did you get French doors in that fridge, bro? No. Because we... Because she My wanted, man, if that fridge ain't French, I don't want it. Because she was like, I want this fridge. She's a Frenchophobe. And it was like, you know, like, I don't know, $600, $650, or something like that. And I was like... <laughs> Big bucks over here. I was like, it's too too pricey. I was like, just get the white one. It's like four hundred fifty, and she's like, but it doesn't match the rest of our appliances. And I'm like, okay, compromise. Find a cheaper stainless steel one. <laughs> and then we did. That's exactly what we did. And it ended up being because we got like she wanted like the ice maker installed too. So yeah. like, that do you was... have a fridge with the water in the door? No, it's just an ice maker. Okay, good. You're you're not you're not that much richer than me yet. Um. Oh, you well, found an enemy. Yeah. Um. Oh, is this Jamaica? I think you're in Jamaica plane. Oh no, this is Coast Guard Pier. I've never actually been here before. That's cool. You probably haven't forgot about it. Love blowing up that dog. Shh. Okay, everyone, let's relax. Ooh, mutant hound meat. That's always good. Is it? Yeah, it's pretty good in survival runs. Oh, hey. Oh my oh. god. That guy clocked you. Really? All of them missed. Every single shot. Let's try some quantum out. See where that gets us. Okay, it helped a lot. Ouch. 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 Okay, thank you. Well, this uh, new he got sneak attack. Oh, I think you sneak attacked the dog. Sorry? I was like, oh, why would you get a sneaky check it on? The dog. Oh, there's a guy on the roof. I'm like not taking as much damage as I was a second ago. Well, you've been you've been regenerating health like crazy. The quantum's been like I fucking. Don't know. Wow, so violent. Hey, I see you're reloading. Wow, zero, really. Why was that? Wow, zero, zero damage. Warning growl. Why is why is this zero? Because your arms hurt. Hey, pal. That's the damage. There she is. Bonk. There's a suicide in there, I think. Watch out. Oh no, it's just a tire fire. <laughs> Very similar. I want her to be a million to the <laughs> Kill them. Kill them all. Kill them all. Anyway, um, <laughs> I think, I think, well, I always, I always Ooh, do baby. like Beast from the X-Men. I think that he's a cool one. Oh, you know what? No, fuck that. I want to be Ant-Man. What about Hellboy? Uh, Is that an option? I would rather, uh, if I was going to be anyone in Hellboy, I would probably want to be Professor Broom. Always... Hell, Hellboy is one I always wanted to read. Uh, I always thought Hellboy was really cool and I love the movies. So I never even saw any of it. 
Uh, they're very good, and they're uh, really hi, pal. Whoa, why are you this strong? Okay, you're not that strong. That guy's a little shrimpy for a super mutant. It's like a little uh, for a, for a skull man. He's not that strong. He missed he missed chest and arm day. Uh, do I have any more? Yup. Taking lots of uh, oh god. That didn't do any damage. Hey, I'm out of these bullets. But yeah, I would only be Ant Man. I like Ant Man and the. Uh... What's so great about Mr. Ant? Well, I like. I, I'm always a big fan of like the scientist hero. Um, what about Doctor Strange? He's a nice guy. Doctor Strange is good, but I, I like the more science stuff because that's like. Okay, fuck me. Yeah. It's one of those things where it's like I know it's still very far fetched, but it feels like it could be real because it's like sci it's science. Boom! Oh my god! Why did you choose to live? Of all the arrogant actions. Man, this gun's rad. Uh, sure. There's good. Too good for that tablespoon, friend? Yes. And I probably can't even open this shit. Just kidding. No. I'm hurt real bad. How about a uh, tactical stim pack somewhere around here? There's some. Ew. Red teeth and also a nuka cherry. Ooh. Um, yeah, I always like the science kind of heroes, and I like Ant-Man because he, uh, he has, like, a lot of different forms, and I like the whole idea of, like, the pimp particle that can make things, that can shrink things or, like, make them larger. Is it called the pimp particle? No, the pimp particle. I named it after its discoverer, Hank Pym. Interesting. It's, it's the, it's the particle that he uses to shrink and grow himself, and Scott Lang in the movies, because they... What the hell is that? Is it your cat downstairs? She wasn't. <laughs> Some kind of cat action somewhere. Yeah. That might be worth investigating. How much time in this episode? Uh, this, this could be a 15 or... Yeah, let's All do right. it. Guys, thanks for watching this episode. Guys, we have to investigate cat action. See ya.